What's going on YouTube? Hopefully this is being more consistent. Uh, as if you watched the last video, you'll notice I ended it sitting in this spot, even though it started a week ago. So this video, I'm gonna try to just make it short and sweet and put it up and that'll be that. So I kind of realize it, it's hard for me to make videos because my life is super boring. I'm either working out, which I can't record because the Y doesn't allow cameras, which is understandable. Uh, I'm either working out, I'm working, or I'm sitting around waiting to go to work. Or, you know, if there's a longer period of time, I'm playing video games. So unless like I insert video game clips into the video, or I show myself like sitting on the couch watching Hulu or Netflix for a couple hours, like there's nothing for me to show. So along with these videos that are probably gonna have very little content in them, I am going to start posting my workouts on my website that I hardly ever use. <laughs> so there will be a link in the description. There's always been a link in the description. I just never really promote it because I never really add anything to it. I don't know if I've even touched it in the last couple months. Every once in a while, I'll go on just to check to see if there's any traffic and it's like one or two people look at it like every month. So I need to get more stuff going that way because I am paying money for the domain name and for the website itself and I need to utilize that, otherwise it's just money down the drain. So, starting today, so this, today's Tuesday, I don't know, this video, if I post the last video today, this video will come out Wednesday, or knowing me, next Wednesday. Anyways, link in the description to the website. Um, in this video, I'll add another link to the specific page, but I'm just going to start posting my workouts that I'm doing. So right now, I am, prepping for summer shredding, I guess. So uh, in the last video, I said I was gonna do the, the video for the contest. I haven't done that yet. I'll probably do that when I go inside maybe. But uh, right now I am kind of doing like a strength bulking kind of phase because I don't wanna start shredding now when the, I get, the deadline is July 1st. Uh, but I don't want to be like cutting weight all that to like five months. So I'm going to do a little bulk till March and then once March hits, we're going. But I'll be posting my workout every single day so that uh, you can follow along for free. You don't have to go on there and buy anything. And that'll be that. Right now I'm doing triphasic uh, for the first two lifts. I'm trying to kind of figure out how I'm going to do it. I don't know if I should be doing it every single day or if I do like every, so do it every day or every other day. Right now I'm trying to do two body parts a day, whether that's both part, if I have enough time, both parts at the same time or two separate times during the day. But I'm trying to figure out, like I did legs and chest yesterday I'm trying to decide if I should do the try or the like the, I did the eccentric I'm trying to decide if I should do eccentric again on Thursday when I do legs or chest or if I should just go and do like regular stuff because the eccentric takes a huge toll on your central nervous system like I could already I was doing a eccentric uh, barbell shoulder press today and it hurt me I was like leaning forward on my legs in between the sets and it hurt my shoulders to be leaning forward after the first set of them or maybe the second set the first set I didn't use as much weight because I had no idea how much to do after the second set I couldn't even lean forward my shoulders were hurting so bad and I'm not even using that much weight it's just the whole controlling it down for five seconds uh, really takes a toll on your body so that's why I don't want to necessarily do it twice a week unless maybe I do like a different exercise. So like instead of doing barbell shoulder press, maybe I do dumbbell shoulder press, even though that's kind of the same movement. I don't know, I did it with squats and that did not go well. I had it planned for 70% of my squat and it was supposed to be seven seconds to start off. That didn't happen. I ended up doing four or five seconds with maybe 
50% of my squat, a little over 50%, maybe 60%. So I just got to play around with it. And that's why I can't just post a workout all together for you guys to follow along because it's going to change every single day based on how I feel it's going to work. So look for that. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video whenever I come up with an idea of something to record. Peace.